Okay, now Samsung DeX is an incredible feature offered by Samsung on its flagship phones, which can turn your phone's operating system into a fully blown PC on a bigger screen. In this video, we are going to see how powerful this feature is and what all we can do with this. And at the end, I will tell you the limitations as well. So let's dive right in. We can use this feature in two different ways, wired DeX and wireless DeX. The wide DeX works on a simple USB type C to C cable or C to A cable or C to HDMI cable. Wireless DeX can be connected to TV, PC or a monitor provided they have Miracast feature built in. If you want to know how to connect them wirelessly, you can check out my other video links which I've left in the description. All right, now here I have a Lenovo monitor which came with this powerful type C cable which can display the content in high resolution. All I need to do is connect the cable to the phone. The DeX opens up on the monitor without needing to do anything. That is a seamless connectivity we have here. Now, if you want to connect this to the PC or a laptop, you need to install DeX software on the system to use this feature. Now, coming back to the monitor, as you can see, it's a cool desktop view we have here. This is the same One UI based on Android in desktop mode. Here you can see we have some apps on the desktop and more can be added. On the taskbar, we have app icon. Tapping on that will open up all the applications. We can scroll through it, right click to add them on desktop. The second icon on the taskbar can show the recently used applications. Next, we have home and back button. On the right side, we have quick toggles, notifications, etc. This is about the layout. Now, when it comes to the usability of these apps, all the stock apps, Google apps, and most third-party applications can open up in full screen window. However, the layout looks blown out and doesn't offer a good experience. For example, if you look at Amazon app, as you can see, the contents on this page are everywhere and it is not easy to navigate. The scrolling experience is bad as well. Likewise, on most of the third-party applications, we are going to see this issue. However, the stock applications and Google Apps work perfectly fine. That is something to note here. Now, if you are into video and photo editing, DeX offers a great experience in this area. As you can see, to edit the contents, just open the gallery, right-click on an image or video, click on Create. This is the same menu options we will see on the phone as well. Tap on Create a Movie. Here we have editing options on the right side. We can add more files, add transition effects. All these options are available on the phone, but editing it on a bigger screen is a different experience altogether. It is easy to navigate and easy to work on it. All right, now how about browsing experience? Let's open Samsung Internet Browser. As you can see here, it offers a proper desktop browsing experience. We have many options on the top right corner. We have all the open tabs here on the top. Tapping on recent button will show all the web pages here. That is how the browsing looks on DeX. Okay, now if you want to make a video call on, let's say WhatsApp or any other applications, just place the phone on a stand or next to the monitor facing you so that the camera can capture your face. You can make a video call on the app on DeX. The DeX will use the phone's camera and we can see the person on bigger screen. If you're doing this on a PC or a laptop, you can access both your phone as well as your desktop contents while having a video call. This is how video calling works on DeX. Now let's open settings. As you can see, we have a dedicated settings menu for DeX. Here we can change the font size, screen zoom, wallpapers, etc. to customize it depending on your need. This is how you can use Samsung DeX on a monitor. If you connect the same to a PC or a laptop, you can have access to both your PC and phone on a single screen. Copying contents from your phone to PC is much easier. From the gallery or my files on DeX, just select and drag images and videos onto the desktop. That is quick and easy, isn't it? We get quick access to notifications to which we can respond right from the big screen. We don't really have to check the phone back and forth while we are doing some important work on the PC. That is the purpose of connecting DeX on a PC or a laptop. Now, another cool thing about DeX is connecting it wirelessly to a TV. The TV should have Miracast built in. Just open DeX on phone. It will search and show the TV model. Tap on it to connect. Once connected, we can use the phone screen as mouse pointer or we can use a dock to connect mouse and keyboard to the phone. This way you can launch DeX on the TV and play your videos or images. Meanwhile, you can use your phone to do what you gotta do 
on your small screen. That is just fantastic. You can also use it for presentations to your clients on a larger screen. This is how Samsung DeX feature can be used on different hardwares in different ways. Now let's talk about the caveats. First thing is you really have to use a good high speed type C cable to use this feature seamlessly without resolution drops, especially when you are connecting it to a monitor. Like I mentioned earlier, all third party applications are not optimized for this particular feature. So it is not a good experience with third party apps. Connecting wireless decks on TV is a pain if you have a non Samsung TV. On most non Samsung TVs, it doesn't work. Not all TVs come with Miracast, so it's really difficult to know if it works on your TV before you buy a Samsung phone with DeX feature. Having said all this, Samsung DeX is certainly a powerful feature which offers PC-like experience on the go. All you need is a small monitor, a Samsung phone with DeX support, a compact keyboard and a mouse. If you have a PC with you, using it on a PC or TV is also quite productive. This is a great feature made by Samsung and I hope they keep updating this feature and keep improving it in coming days. That's about it guys. This is Samsung DeX for you. Any questions, thoughts, drop a comment. If you like the contents of the channel, do subscribe and smash the like button if you find value in this video. Thanks for watching. My name is Salian signing off. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye. Thank you.